Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with another cool project in Turtle Academy. We are going to make something that might amaze you. So let's get cracking. Friends, the first step is to visit turtleacademy.com and then choose login. And then we always choose login with Google. Make sure it says your name up here. When it does, you can click on the profile and then you need to find your program. My program is on page two, and remember it was called Logo MDH. You need these commands for what we're gonna do today. Uh, go, SQ, and Cool. You can pause the movie and rebuild those if you lost them. You also need Wow, Grow, Grow To, Poly, XY. So once again, you can pause and type those in super fast. Make sure you are paying attention to the brackets. Those are all essential, and then finally, and then finally, you need SRC as well. These down here, you can just comment out. They are fun if you want to see your old ones, but you do not need them at the moment. We will finish using this label again. I'm going to remind you quickly to hit save because remember, this does not save for you. You need to do that whenever you finish creating new code or making adjustments like I just made those comments. So today's lesson, we are going to make a word called a maze. So type a maze and then put colon P, which is gonna stand for polygons. And let's do colon L, and I always do shift L, which will be the length. And let's do colon A, which will be the angle. We are gonna type repeat. And then of course we need to put how many, and I'm gonna tell you 100 is a good number, and then do the square. And then we're gonna use the set random color command. After set RC, we're gonna type poly, and then we're gonna put those variables, colon P and colon L. After that, we're gonna do right, and we're gonna do colon A, and close it with a square bracket. Press enter, and let's put end. Just like that, you have made today's command. First, we're gonna hit save, so we don't lose it. And then remember, you have to type your command here, so we're gonna type maze, and I want you to do an old traditional one, except now it's gonna be really pretty, with 100, and then I want you to do 20 for the degrees per turn. On your screens, I want you to hit run without me hitting it. I'm gonna count to three, or actually I'm talking to three, and now when I hit run, you'll be able to see how awesome yours will turn out. All right, let's quickly learn a new command to make this even cooler. And I want you to type a new command called set and it's width, W-I-D-T-H. And then we're gonna change it to four. So remember, whenever you do this, though, before the word end, you need to type it one more time so that it goes back to size one. You don't ever want to leave it thick. Now, when you hit run, check out how cool it looks. Now, you can put any numbers while you're experimenting with the widths. Just make sure you always end with a one. All right, friends, so there is your logo training for today. Once again, make sure you save it. And then I'm also going to tell you to make sure you have different numbers than me. Pick something awesome, change it, make sure that it's super cool so that it's one that I've never seen before. You need to make sure it also has your name on it. So I'm just going to delete that comment. And this time when I save, it'll save that little picture with the output image. If I hit run, it'll have the new one, which is what you would turn in with your name buried in there somewhere. I'm going to give you one more quick reminder. Don't forget to hit save, and don't forget to give me that screenshot. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give me a like. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.